Welcome back in the kitchen again with Chef Ricardo Cooking Show. It's amazing to be in the kitchen, guys, giving you some lovely recipes and ideas. Anyway, uh, every day I keep making different kind of food, different kind of dishes, you know what I mean? And as the days goes by, we're learning more and more ideas, you know what I mean? I, I honestly, I, I have two panini right here, and honestly, I made a sandwich about two days ago. And it's one of the most lovely sandwich I ever eat for such a long time. The sandwich is so nice and lovely. But the thing I'm gonna to say to you today, I'm gonna to be using mackerel to make the sandwich today. And also we're gonna put some apple cider vinegar. And um, we're gonna put some mayonnaise, salad cream, pepper spring onion, and some white onion inside of it. Guys, it's one of the most beautiful sandwich you could ever, ever have in this summer. Honestly, it is amazing. So I'm gonna be showing you how to make this sandwich at home and honestly Give it a try and give it a go. Please follow me on Instagram and Twitter, Facebook, Google Plus me and get your lovely recipe from Chef Ricard and the team. Guys, I want to say take the time to say I love every one of you. Thank you so much for subscribing and leaving your comments in the description box. It's just amazing. All right, stay tuned. Don't go anywhere and please watch this video. All right, guys, it's an amazing video. You know what happened? This sandwich, honestly, the day when I eat it, you know, I want to take the time even to say thanks, Sharon, for this recipe. It is just a beautiful recipe. It just, you know what I mean, inspire me more to make some nice, lovely sandwich like this as the summer comes and goes. All right, so stay tuned and don't go anywhere. Nice and lovely, guys. So basically, this is the mackerel which I've been using. You can go to any local shop or supermarket that you can buy skinless and boneless mackerel filet in sunflower oil all right so what i'm going to do is to strain the mackerel i'm going to be opening it and i'm going to be straining off that oil i don't need that oil so i'm going to strain the mackerel and not the big the, the most important thing with this mackerel it doesn't come with any bone so you don't need to worry yourself about bone the only thing i will say to you if you go to the local shop or supermarket please look for the one which you're gonna buy if you want to take out the the the, the bone there's no problem all right so i just drain the mackerel and that's it right here as you can see it went looking so lovely there's no bone and there is no no bone inside of it you know the mackerel always come with a backbone nothing like that all right guys so, what we're going to do, I'm going to simply put on a little bit of pepper and also just a pinch of hot pepper sauce. If you have any hot pepper sauce, you can put a little pinch. Also, we're going to put a tiny pinch of apple cider vinegar. If it doesn't have apple cider vinegar, please use lime juice. Lovely and nice. And also we're going to put roughly about a tablespoon of salad cream. Then we're going to go over to the mayonnaise. And we're going to put roughly about a teaspoon of the mayonnaise. It's an amazing recipe, guys. You might have said, Chef Ricardo, this is too easy and simple for you. But it's just effect of it. It's just amazing. And then what we're going to do, I'm just going to cut up one spring onion. Very finely. Because I love my spring onion, guys. Then what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get the white onion and I'm gonna simply cut off just a little piece of the white onion, roughly about a quarter. And I'm gonna cut that up really finely also. This recipe you can make it and bring it to work. It's just amazing recipe. Nice one. That's it so far. All right. And all I'm going to do is just use my wooden spoon and just give it a lovely mix like this. If you're a person who love like 
chili hot pepper, chili pepper and all this thing you can put in it. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pop this in my fridge now. I'll make that chill in the meantime, I'm gonna do my panini bread, all right? So basically, this is my panini bread right here. And all I'm going to do is take out one, simple, cut into half, just like that. So I'm going to toast it in my toaster, or if you have a grill, you can grill the bread. Also, all right, guys. So let's go into business. After we finish this, then we're gonna take it to the next level. What next? I love the guys. And this is the bread I just toasted, and you can see the pinini bread looking so lovely and nice. Look a bit warm, same way. But what we're going to do now is put on that nice, lovely mackerel, which we just. Um, two things. You could ever. Some people normally would butter their bread, but um, I'm not gonna be buttering mine. I'm just gonna just leave it just like that. To show the fans exactly what they can do at home. This is amazing, guys. Look at that. And all they're going to do is just put this on top of it like this. Now see that? And that looking lovely and nice. You can make this and bring it to work. Honestly, your co-worker then will definitely love this one, guys. This is an amazing recipe. Please enjoy the recipe and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Thank you so much for watching Chef Ricardo show. We got a lot more recipe and a lot more ideas will be coming. This is from Chef Ricardo. This is just a simple summer summer sandwich for the fun them guys. So as you can see, mackerel is very easy to prepare. You can make this bread to work or you can do something else, whatever you like to make. But please enjoy it and subscribe to the YouTube channel and I will see you with more recipe like this. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.